evening. Good evening. We are so glad that you can come here tonight for our fourth grade musical. We are going to have a great night of listening to our children sing and worship. And um, to start us off, we have Audrey up here who's going to open us up in a word of prayer. Please bow your heads and close your eyes for a word of prayer. Dear Lord, thank you for music and celebration. Please help us do great on, on our performance and bless each family, teacher, principal, kid, even the sound guy up there. Also, bless M M Mrs. Strixma for letting this play happen. In Jesus' name, amen. sunshine, a balloon without helium, a burger without fries. Jacob can be very dramatic, if you know what I mean. Well, Jacob, it would be a very serious thing if you actually did lose music. But are you sure it's completely gone? Yes, yes, completely. Listen. <gasps> wow, he's right. Like a train without a whistle, like a bear without a growl, like a cow without a moo. Like a burger without fries. Well, Jacob, maybe we can all help you get your music back. Yes, hurry, but how will we do it? We'll build it. Build it? Oh, I know. We'll build Jacob's music back by using all the elements of music. Then it will be whole again. Great, Great idea. idea. Elements? I don't know. I thought elements were like minerals and gases and stuff. Well, in a way, the elements in music are similar to the elements found in nature. And if you put those elements together, you can make amazing things. Well, come on, Einstein. Let's get going. Where should we start? Have you ever had one of those songs in your head that you can't seem to forget? Yeah, sure have. The tune you hear is called the melody. The melody is one of the most important elements of music.
But surely there's more to music than just melody. Of course there is. Melody is just one of the elements of music. Well, give me something else, please. I have a beating headache. Perfect! Perfect? What do you mean, perfect? One of the most important elements of music is all, is all around the pounding beat. It's called rhythm. Rhythm is the element of music that gives the pulse and beat. Let's get it going! it a lot more interesting. Harmony is especially interesting when you're putting music all together. You can sing one part and I can add another and together we can make beautiful music. Hey folks, you're singing my song. Hit me with some harmony and move this tune along.
Hello? Hello, Mr. Jacob. I'm calling to inform you that you have been randomly selected to receive a lifetime supply of tone quality, which we are sure you will enjoy. In order to, to receive your free tone supply, please send a check or money order for $500 before tomorrow at 6 p.m. Then we will supply you with a beautiful tone we know you will enjoy. Wow, $500 for tone quality seems a little expensive. Tone quality isn't something that you have to pay for. It's just another element of music that's yours absolutely free. The element of tone is diverse and plentiful as the colors of the rainbow. It can be fun to experiment with, even to make your music sound different. Even when melody, rhythm, harmony, and tone are all the same. Huh? Sure, our voices can sound happy or sad, bright or dark. Big or small? So remember, Jacob, watch that tone in your voice. in some sort of order. It organizes the elements so that it all makes sense. Huh? Look, let me introduce you to some of my friends. Ladies and gentlemen, let's get it up for Rondo and the ABC! <laughs> Yo, thank you very much. Thank you. I heard you have some questions about form. That's right, Rondo. Jacob here is trying to get his music back. He has already learned melody, rhythm, harmony, and tone. Now, we're just hoping you could shed some light on the musical element of form for us. Yo, yo, I've come to the right place, Mr. Rondo's my name, and is my game. Get the picture. Yes, yes, yes! 
we get it. So get a beat going, dude, and let Rondo and the ABCs explain the word of form to you. Another time, pal. We're out of here. Ladies and gentlemen, Rondo and the ABCs! <laughs> so, Jacob, now that you have melody, harmony, rhythm, tone, and form, don't forget form, what are you going to do with all these elements? What do you mean, what am I going to do with them? I'm going to make music. But what are you going to say? Oh, you're right. I think I should add some words. Not necessarily. Although lots of music has words, you can make wonderful music without any words at all. But you should probably think about what you want to say with your music, even if you say it without any words. Huh? You say it a lot, don't you? Making music with, with your voice, an instrument, or even your body is more than just mastering all elements we've talked about so far. Music. You have the opportunity to communicate like nothing else. Use your music, Jacob. Use it to say something that is important to you. Express your mind. Express your heart. Express yourself, Jacob. Express yourself.
believe in me. Okay. Like melody and rhythm, harmony and tone, form and expression. He put them all together and now he's practically unstoppable. I'm on top of the world. He's still very dramatic. <laughs> what could be more wonderful than to be back with my music? Your music never really left you, Jacob. You just had to develop the tools to get it out of yourself. Spoken like a true teacher. Music and me, together at last. Like a beer with a growl. Like a burger with fries. Like music and me. Thank you so much for coming and enjoying our program that we've been working on in class. As you know, these students have been in my students, many of them, since kindergarten, and this is their last year as regular elementary um, music students. Next year they get to go to band and orchestra, so this was fun to put together our last little program for, for you. And um, Ms. Mrs. Connell and Mr. Coy are both ready to, and they are ready for you. So. 
Next year, you will all appreciate getting to learn about them and their instruments. And um, I just want to thank you, parents, for being so supportive over the years coming to our music programs. And thank you for um, trusting your kids with us. And uh, it's just been a privilege to teach them. So I just want to say thank you for that. And this is Mrs. Van Camp, and she's going to close our program. Let's also give Mrs. Struxma a round of applause. wonderful tonight. Let's go ahead and close out in a word of prayer. Dear Lord, we are so thankful for the many blessings you have given us. We thank you for the beautiful children on the stage tonight. We thank you for the message they shared. We thank you, Lord, most of all for music tonight. Lord, you are worthy of all of our praise. We thank you for the gift of music to lift our hearts and enhance our worship. I pray we can sing your praises daily. Please be with us as we head home tonight and as we finish the school year. Lord, I pray that we can all finish strong. We give this night to you and we give this time to you. In your name we pray. Amen. All right, have a good night.